Jeremoja Baby Ajiman, also known as Reverend Aberby Clegg Jr., made his transition on February 20, 2000, while living on our Beulah Land farm located in Calhoun Falls, South Carolina. Jeremoji was a man of faith, conviction, and integrity. Jeremoji was not ashamed to tell the world that he was a Christian. In fact, Jeremoji was often quoted as saying, everything I did, I did because I was a Christian. Jeremoji loved black people so much that the funds that were generated from his book that was written in 1972 entitled Black Christian Nationalism, New Direction for the Black Church, which was translated into over 14 different languages. All the funds that he raised from that book, he plowed back into building a black nation with power here on earth. The lives of thousands of members of the Pan-African Orthodox Christian Church and countless brothers and sisters around the world have been forever transformed because Reverend Clegg made the most of the time that God gave him on this earth and he used his gifts for the upliftment of black people. Few organizations, be they spiritual or secular, have had the success of making the transition after the founder of that organization or spiritual movement has passed away. However, the Pan-African Orthodox Christian Church has not only survived the passing of our beloved founder, though slow and sometimes awkwardly, we have expanded the ministry of the Pan-African Orthodox Christian Church onto the continent of the motherland Africa. This expansion makes real our mission to be a pan-African Orthodox Christian church. However, for those of us who remain on this side of the Jordan, we are being challenged and even compelled to carry on the vision of our beloved founder by maximizing our human potential in the ongoing struggle for the survival and the liberation of black people all over the world. Jeremoji Abebe Ajiman, we thank you for leave, leaving us an example of service leadership. For you never ask what's in it for me, but you ask God, how can I use the gifts that you have given me to expand the influence of black people all around the world? Jeremoji served black people until he took his last breath. Therefore, as practitioners of the philosophy of black Christian nationalism, we are each called, compelled, and challenged not only by Jeremoji or Baby Ajiman, but by the God we serve to do no less. Amen? amen. And amen. amen. Jeremoji or Baby Ajiman, we thank you for your gifts. We thank you for watching over us from the black cosmos, pushing us to go on, to continue fighting, continue struggling when it's proud to be black and when it's not fashionable to be black. We thank you for pushing us from the other side to do your will. Amen. Amen.